Hello guys, welcome to today's lesson. Today I'm going to be walking you through the key of G and um, we'll walk through all of the chords diatonically and um, what that means is we'll be going through the scale degrees and we'll play the appropriate chords and starting with the roots, G major scale has just one sharp and that is F sharp so you know, it's more uh, or less similar to C. C has zero sharps, zero flats, no flat, no sharp. But here, just have just one sharp, and on the piano, it's just one black key. So I have G, then I have A as my second degree in G. I'm going through G major scale G, A, B, C, D, E, F sharp, and back to G. So let's just see how that, how we, we can play that. You must remember also that every chord in every key they have their um, scale degrees um, the one chord the fourth chord and the fifth chord are always major for triads so the two chord the three and the sixth chord are always minor and the seventh is diminished so let's just go you have g major as my root so this is my home chord here it's going to sound um, for if you're using so far it's going to be a do, do then your re, your two is going to be A minor. So you can play it um, more or less chords that you've learned already. So this is A minor, you can play it on any position A minor, A minor, A minor, A minor. Uh, A minor. So, so let me go back to G, then the second is A, then the third is B minor. So it's just similar. It, this is your regular way of holding your E minor. You can just change your fingering in such a way where you'll be able to bar with this. So this is my root E minor. So I just have to change it to a B minor. So I just hold my chord like this, A minor. So I can easily move just every chord is moving on the guitar. Once you change the fingering to a closed kind of closed fret open. So let's just, this is B e minor from the top, G major, your two, your re is A e minor, B e minor, then we have F major, this is, uh, sorry, C major, as you find, this is C, you can play any of your C inversions, so let's just go, so but here I'll just be using a main chord, so this is G, then five. it is your C, then your Fifth chord is a D. D. So I can use any of the D. I can use any of the D. So. Do, re, mi, fa, so we are moving then. The sixth chord is E. So that is E minor. E minor. So I can have different inversions. This is my also E minor. It's also E minor. So just E minor. And then the last but not the least is your F sharp. So this is F sharp. This is G. This is F sharp diminished. So to play this, um, this is it. So just remember your. Let me give you a quick tip. Remember your D minor chord. So just use this fingering. Change the fingering. Just take it up, but now we're going to move this shape one fret higher, then we we'll move it up. So it's just like D minor. So just move it up. So you start from string five. Then you just roll over with your finger one. So I'm just playing six, five. Four, three. So here is the fingering. Finger one, I'm holding my F sharp. Then with finger three, I'm holding my C. Then I'm holding my um, F sharp also on the fourth fret. Then I finish up with with my A. So this is your F sharp diminished. Then finish up with G. Make reference to these chords later on.
see you in the next class.